if you do the work consistently, if you invest in yourself consistently, 10 years of motherfucking work when everybody else is partying, making excuses, doing the cool thing on the weekend, is going to pay off. You can do this. LeBron, before we revisit the game, there was a moment with Luca, and he told us prior to the game, he said, I won't compare myself to LeBron, but he was the man I watched. So can you describe that just brief exchange with him and how good he was tonight? I mean, you never know who you can inspire, you know, along your path, and you hope that you can inspire the next generation. And, and for me, by me playing the game the right way, always getting my teammates involved and playing for the purity of the game, I was able to inspire a kid that wasn't even in America. And, and, and that's pretty special. And, and obviously we see what he's capable of doing, his ability to make plays not only for himself, for his teammates to rebound and just play for the pure love of the game. Um, it's a beautiful thing to watch. Yeah, he got it. Um, he gonna be a problem. He already a problem. Uh, but, you know, he, he gonna be really good for a long time. You know, he kind of had the questions of like, oh, can he do that in the NBA like he's doing in the EuroLeague? He can, you know, you know, he's exciting to watch, so, you know, he'll be good for a long time. He's kind of lifted that franchise. Uh, you know, I feel like his, he's been having a lot of moments, you know, so far this season, so as soon as I seen him flip the ball up in the air, I was just like, we're going to make this, we're going to have to, you know, we're going to have to go win it in overtime, so. You know, he's a really, really, really good player, you know, not just for a rookie. He's not the quickest, he's not the fastest, he's not the most athletic, but he's just, he's such a cerebral player. And with Steph being out, I know Kyrie is out right now. Westbrook is still playing. I'm going to say this. He is the best point guard in the game right now with Steph being out. He's an amazing player. He can find his teammates. He can create his own shots. High IQ player. You know, I'm not surprised at all. He's a good player. I mean, you know, he's a typical European, which is comes in and it has a you know a certain handle and a certain savvy about him. Uh, plays above his age, you know. Uh, he doesn't play like a 19 or 20 year old, so um, you can tell he's been playing against some high level competition. He's good. I mean, he's he's got an advantage over most rookies. He's going to play professionally a lot sooner than a lot of these guys, and it shows. Uh, he has a veteran pro level game. You know, he's 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 a special talent. He has game. He's stepping into a situation like, I'm used to this. I've been playing against grown men since he was probably like 12, 13 years old. And Luca, in my eyes, is one of the top five most talented players in the league right now and must watch TV. I mean, I, I, I mean, he's been five, not, not, not second year players. Top five most talented, I'm saying, and most fun to watch.